All right, let's take a look at that neighborhood forecast here for tonight. Turned out to be a gorgeous afternoon across the area. It looks like we're going to see a continuation of that fall feel that we had this morning. We had those temperatures into the 40s and 50s. Looks like we're headed back there again here for tomorrow morning. And actually, the next couple of mornings are going to be on the cool side before we start to warm things up later in the week. Here's where we stand temperature-wise in the metro right now. As we can see, we're looking at readings anywhere from the low to mid to upper 70s. Right now, we're at the in the upper 70s for the Inner Harbor. But you get out towards Ellicott City, 73 degrees there. Abingdon, same thing for Cockeysville. Finksburg at 72 and down into Anne Arundel County. We're looking at temperatures tonight, or at least uh, right now, into the low uh, 70s. We're going to be dropping into the 50s here overnight tonight. So you can see across the area, 60 for Annapolis, 52 for Bowie tonight, up towards Westminster. Some areas, again, into the upper 40s. As you can see out towards Mount Airy, 49 degrees. Same thing for Frederick Bruns Brunswick at 48 degrees. So a crisp, cool night across the area. We're going to be watching some high clouds streaming in from the west, and that will slow the temperatures from cooling off too much overnight tonight. But look at this. We've got 50s and upper 40s across Hartford and Cecil County here for tonight. So another chilly night on the way. But if you have any plans for this evening, the weather's going to be fine. Very comfortable. Overnight tonight, though, we're going to start to see those few of those clouds start to move, make their way into the region. Temperatures again by the time you wake up tomorrow morning into the mid 50s. Now let's talk about what's expected for the rest of the week. Well, if you've been looking for a continuation of the beautiful weather, you're going to see it as high pressure remains in control. There are those high clouds I was talking about that will be streaming into the region here uh, later tonight. and will likely continue through the day tomorrow, so we'll call it partly cloudy here for your Wednesday. As Futurecast shows, there they are right there. We stay dry, though, tomorrow, Thursday, and into most of Friday. But by late Friday, we're going to start to see a few of these scattered showers, maybe some drizzle start to sneak into the area as moisture makes its way back into the region. And then we've got wet weather in the forecast for Friday night and into Saturday. But it looks like all this moves out by the time we head towards Sunday, and things are going to be drying out across the area. So, again, Cecil County for tonight. Temperatures upper 40s to around 50 degrees, so another cool night there. Highs tomorrow topping out into the mid to upper 70s. And for Harford County tonight, we're looking at readings into the upper 40s to around 50 degrees. Jarrettsville tonight down to 49. Edgewood 52. Joppa Town highs tomorrow reaching the mid to upper 70s. So a beautiful day shaping up. All right, here's your first alert 7 day forecast. As I mentioned, the next couple of days, partly cloudy skies. Highs right around 80 degrees for tomorrow as well as Thursday. Clouds on the increase with a chance for rain in the forecast by late Friday. And then it looks like the best chance for rain that will come in on Saturday. The weekend will not be a complete washout with dry weather and sunshine returning Sunday into next week. Denise? All right, thank you, Derek. Well,